Hi Leos! Welcome to my channel. We're doing your first week of February. Okay, we're gonna answer will you guys ever be together? Or the things that you guys uh, need to work on also. I'm excited it. Okay, so let's see what's going on for you guys. Oh, we're gonna get first focus energy for the first week of February. Okay, this is the oracle. Let me see. Focus on this Leos. Here we go. You have here birth. Ooh. Maybe something new, or maybe getting pregnant, or, well, you know, seeing through things in a new light, in a new way. Okay, that's what I'm sensing here with the birth. Okay, a new cycle begins probably. Okay, so let's see. Mm -hmm. Let's see what's going on for my Leos. Ah! Mm! I saw this before when I was shuffling. It's the star card. Hopeful, yes. Destined, yes. Um, you know, following the path, you know, basically. Um, you know, this is when you wish upon a star. Basically, that's what you did. Um, can be connecting with an acquire another air sign. There's also the path of lead that leads towards your healing process, of course. Um, this is about um, signs and symbols, synchronicity that you have been like, you know, like, oh, here, oh, there, oh, here, or there. So you're very, very much intuitive also from what I'm sensing here. Okay. Very, very positive over here. Now, let's see what it's leading to. It, leading, it leads you towards your happiness. So, um, the person that you're connecting with, you're happy. You're just happy, plain and simple. I'm sensing you're talking also to your friends about this because Three of Cups for me is the gossip girl, basically. It's a sex and deceit card where you go out with your girlfriends and then you guys talk. And you're talking about this person that you met and, you know, it's like, for you, it's just like, hey, listen, it's like, this is this and that. And then this is how this person makes me happy. Da 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 da, -da. Okay? Very positive. Oh, King of Pentacles. This is that person. Can be an Earth sign, Virgotaurus, Capricorn. High vibration, very, very much responsible. And this is what you like about this person because they're responsible about their time. Their pentacles is time for me. So um, you like that. This is what you're telling to the to, to girlfriends over here. Or if not, so if it's not your friends, you know, your family and relatives, you're talking to them about this person very particularly because this is like, if they're the hope card, if they're the star card, because for you, you know, it's like, this is the one that you have been requesting and wishing for. Ooh, oh, strong earth energy because you have the devil card. This person can be addicted to you, addicted to you, Leo. Okay, if not, vice versa. Okay, um, but I'm sensing, yeah, they're addicted to you, Leo, because it's like the, the this is the earth and this is the devil card, so attachment, but it goes both ways, though. Okay, it goes both ways because the devil card needs the, the feminine and masculine also to be together. If not, Leos, you guys share amazing intimate connection, and that's why you're giggling with your girlfriends. <laughs> okay, and then you oh, six of cups, Leos, wow, very positive because this energy is about you know, soulmate, past karma, and emotional abundance. This is the only cup that is not filled with water it's filled with different stuff because you feel amazing okay this can be even like you know you guys are intimate and then you wake up you feel amazing okay because this is the this is the glow that everyone sees in you and you're not gonna tell them why you're glowing okay so that kind of energy also this is um you know this is reconnecting to you and soulful experience is what you're having here also soulful and earthy experience and if you're wishing for someone to come back this can be the person also that came back to your life which is a capricorn also okay let me see here oh wow definitely you are where you're supposed to leo the last card is the strength card which is you and with me First spread, when you come out, it means you are where you're supposed to. So there's no doubt about it that this person that you're connecting with, I don't sense malefic, not at all. I sense emotional fulfillment it will come soon. Um, however, there's some sort of possessiveness that, that there's happening here right now, okay? And, you know, it's like, of course, um, devil card is goes extra, okay? So can be you guys are, oh my gosh, my soulmate, my soulmate. You're going too overboard over this situation about the whole soulmate because the six of cups is soulmate. Devil card goes extra, meaning don't go there. Like, you know, it's like you have to understand the connection more and it's not just all about the magic. Okay, that's one thing. And this person also goes on the seven, on the King of Pentacles. So they go on the overboard, can be like giving you so much material stuff because the devil is the material energy also. So they're addicted to you and you're addicted to them because uh, it's like, it goes both ways. Um, you're addicted, this person is addicted to you in 
can be in physical form and your uh, the other person is addicted to you leo because they're addicted to soulmate energy like they're very much in gross in gross on it okay it's like they're that's where they're at okay so that's that's what i'm sensing here but okay here's the but with this friend card as the last card which we need to focus on first card strongest last card strongest also with me um anything difficult even the devil card that's passing so that's over the addiction is over the extreme obsession is over healing was he, healing was already present this devil card is done basically okay so that was a stage that you guys were in now i'm going to continue this reading as it moves forward if you guys will ever be together and since it's good energy over here um so thank you very much guys for watching have a wonderful wonderful first week of february i'll see you guys again bye